In a lab nearly 6,500 miles from Wuhan, researchers in Berkeley, California, are looking to bats to find clues on how to help humans fight coronaviruses like COVID-19. So I think in a way, there's actually a lot we can learn from bats. You know, this group of animals that's been around for millions of years, how can we look at their history with viruses and take that knowledge and think about therapeutics and treatments for ourselves? Scientists believe that understanding a bat's immune system can help develop a human battle plan for fighting these diseases on a global scale. It's an opportunity. What is it about the bat's metabolism, immunity or physiology that they've got that we could use? Bats might actually hold an answer for treating viruses. If bats can handle thousands of different viruses at a much higher load than humans can, let's find out why and use that. Scientists believe COVID-19 may have had its roots in a community of horseshoe bats in southeastern China. These particular bats represent a very small subset of horseshoe bats all named for the shape of their noses. In fact, there's incredible diversity among bat species. Bats can be found living all around the world on every continent except Antarctica. However, the diversity and unique abilities of bats is also what makes them tough to contend with when it comes to disease. They're the only mammal capable of actually flying, so they can easily spread viruses to other animals in communities. Some bat species actually migrate thousands of miles, and hence the viruses that they carry traffic along those migratory routes. And though some of the pathogens bats play host to can make them sick, like rabies, they also have the unique ability to host and withstand some viruses without getting sick. Understanding how bats coexist with diseases is very critical. Bats have a very unique relationship with pathogens generally. They, they have a unique biology, and it allows them to coexist with pathogens in different ways. 